Uh, no, we're keeping up and by planting more trees than we're removing, we're getting ahead. So uh, we try, we now know that it's pretty well across the city in different areas and across the province. We've seen uh, an increase in populations uh, and new finds this summer uh, in many areas. So it's on track from where we looked at it in 2008 and kind of doing our analysis of the forest cover. Uh, we are seeing populations increase, but we're also now over the over the hump in some wards uh, that we you know we've been in and done removals and looking at woodlot maintenance and so we're, it's starting kind of where it should be. But in fact, I feel so strongly about forestry staff here that I'm just prepared to vote in favor of adding or reinstating three staff in the forestry department. I mean, you know, it's not just go to a tree farm and buy a tree and come back and plant it on your front lawn in my ward. They're mainly city-owned front lawns, they're city trees, and we, the homeowner, can't plant a city tree. They have to know where the bell line is, and where the hydro line is. And so there's a lot of work to that, and that's, you know, so, so the city comes along and plants a tree, but there's a lot of admin work in the background to do that, to do the, the uh, searching for the underground utilities.